Hello and welcome to Thoughts of the Day for Wednesday 20th May 2020 and we're returning to Living the Rainbow and today we are thinking about choosing peace. Now this morning with the children in school we were reflecting on last week when we looked at all of the um, the beauty in nature that had um, been particularly noticeable during lockdown and had been and how we'd seen some areas restored um, because people have been using fewer cars, they've been um, travelling less, there's been less pollution, um, and that that's had a really positive impact on our world. And today I asked the children to think about what was peaceful. And what would you think of if somebody said to you, wow, this is so peaceful? Or, it's so peaceful being outside. Or, this classroom is peaceful. The children talked about it being things like it was calm. It was quiet. They could hear birds singing. They could see beautiful things. It, was, it wasn't rushing. Um, and it, there was a fl uh, slower feeling to the, the day or to the moment and we talked about how in those changes um, in, in nature we were able to see some of that peace and then we were really honest for a moment and talked about does it feel like that in your house at the moment sometimes it does feel like that at the moment and then we were really honest again and said mm, Sometimes, particularly at the moment, it doesn't feel peaceful. And we talked about how that might be because there are brothers and sisters that, have, um, that are spending even more time together, so there's a bit of squabbling going on, or um, mum and dad, um, or whoever's at home might be busy doing work and trying to help you with home learning. And so that can sometimes feel a little bit what they described as... Um, Tense um, was one of the words that the children used, and it, it felt less less nice to be around. Um, and in the Bible, in James chapter 1, verse 19, um, Christians are encouraged to take heart, be quick to listen, but slow to speak, and slow to become angry. And at the moment, it might be difficult for us to be peaceful, um, particularly at home when we're with people all day and normally we perhaps have a little bit of, of break, a break from them. Um, and we thought of some strategies to help us if we were feeling a bit angry or a bit frustrated. I wonder if you can think of something that would help you feel calmer again now. Some of the ideas the children came up with were spending some time sat in the garden by themselves, perhaps asking them to go to their room for a little bit to, to calm down, or playing in a different room to brothers and sisters. We talked about things that we could do to help bring that peace. So when mums and dads are asking us to do something, even if we don't want to do it, doing it first time, rather than having to hear that nag of we get up being asked again and again and again. So today, I want you to do two things. Think about how you can make yourself feel more peaceful if you're feeling angry and frustrated. And two, how can you show peace to others in your household? Have a good day.